If you have read Brandon Sanderson's Mistborn trilogy, then perhaps you have considered the shenanigans that might be possible if you had the power to burn the alimantic metals. Should this be the case, I present this short guide to Mistborning as effectively as you can possibly Mistborn. Don't just wear any old thing. Do commission or receive as a gift a mist cloak, the coolest looking but least practical garment in all of Scadriel. Basically a cloak made of ribbons that flaps around you looking dramatic. It might be incredibly noisy, try and catch itself around your legs, and make things like jumping, fighting, or climbing stairs without burning pewter for balance a bit of a challenge, but hey, you'll look awesome. Don't sit. Mistborn, do not sit. Do perch on objects that may or may not be intended for sitting, such as the backs of benches, nearby trees, or anything else that seems Perchable. You are no mere human, you are a magnificent creature of the mists, and slumping in a chair is just beneath you. Don't stand. Do crunch. Whether it's a slight bending of the knees to let your opponents know you're ready to throw down, or a full-on dramatic landing, never stand at your full height, it's just not mysterious enough. Don't look at things. Looking at things is for boring normal people with nothing better to do. You can stare if you must, but best practice is to glance at things. You are a busy mistborn after all, you have things to do. Don't walk. Walking is not nearly dramatic enough. If you're in a hurry, steel push or iron pull. If not, saunter. Or maybe stalk. If you need to be on level ground and move fast, don't run. Regular people run. Mistborn dash. What's the difference? Look, I've got no idea, I'm just the narrator. But it's probably style. Don't sword fight. Seriously? Against Alamancers? Do you want to die? Do get yourself a nice obsidian dagger. Fragile but deadly and completely immune to Alamancy. Don't make friends. Do pull and push on people's emotions to manipulate them. Nah, I'm just kidding. Vin's entire arc in the first book is all about making friends. Do make friends. And influence people. But only for a good cause. Have fun storming the castle. And do try not to get mortally wounded, if you wouldn't mind.